Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing great. Guys, today in this video we are going to configure basic BGP with IPv6. Basic configuration of BGP with IPv6. Between two routers actually I am going to configure uh, BGP with IPv6 address. As you can see on router number one, I am running one loopback address and on that loopback address I am running one IPv6 address. I will advertise this loopback interface IP address in BGP but before that we will understand how to form BGP neighborship between router 1 and router 2 by using IPv6 address. So between router 1 and router 2 I am using network 12 up double colon 0 slash 64. So on router 1 F0 slash 0 I will configure 12 double colon 1 and on router 2 F0 slash 0 I will configure 12 double colon 2. Right. So first of all, I am going to implement IPv6 address on routers. So let me take you on a router directly. On router number one, interface F0 slash 0, IPv6 address, 12 up double colon 1 slash 64. This is command to configure IPv6 address. And let me configure IP on loopback interface as well. So interface loopback 1 IPv6 address and 192 colon 168 colon 10 double colon 1 slash 64. Now if you want to verify the IPv6 configuration command will be do so IPv6 interface brief. This is command to check IPv6 IP configuration right so on interface F0 slash 0 you can see this is my link local address and this is the IPv6 address that is 12 double colon 1 this interface is administratively done so here I need to run no set command as well interface F0 slash 0 said no set right now I am going to configure IPv6 address on router number 2 first then I will show you the BGP configuration config T interface f0 slash 0 first of all let me say no set and then ipv6 address 12 up double colon 2 and slash 64 right here also if you want to verify so you can run command do so ipv6 interface brief instead of ip you will say ipv6 after that command is same to check IP configuration. So here you can see I have configured this IP address 12 double colon 2 on F0 slash 0 and this interface is administratively up and line protocol of this interface is also up. Right. This is nothing but link local IP address. Now let me check the connectivity between router 1 and router 2. So do ping and 12 up double colon 1. So you can see success, success rate is also 100%. That means I am able to ping router 1 from router number 2. Now I am going to configure what? BGP. So guys in case of IPv6, you know in case of BGP configuration with IPv6, first you need to configure the BGP router ID. So router BGP after that AS number let's say 100 I am going to configure IBGP neighborship so on both router I am going to use AS number 100 done after that BGP router ID router ID let's say 1.1.1.1 .1 .1 .1. done in the same way let me enable BGP or let me configure BGP router ID on router number 2 also so router BGP 100 and here also I am going to say BGP router ID is let's say 2.2.2.2 done I've configured BGP router ID on both router now I am going to define neighbor 12 up double colon 2 whose remote AS is nothing but 100 done guys by default you know by default address family is enabled in case of IPv4 address but in case of IPv6 address you know address family is disabled so here we need to enable what IPv6 address family as well but before that you have to enable IPv6 routing on router by default IPv6 routing is also disabled on router 
IPv4 routing is enabled, but IPv6 routing is disabled. So to enable IPv6 routing on router, you need to run command simply IPv6 unicast routing. This command will enable IPv6 routing. So let me run this command on both router, on router 1 also and on router 2 also. IPv6 unicast routing. Done. Done. After that again router BGP S number 100 and my neighbor is 12 up double column 2 whose remote AS is whose remote AS is 100 right after that I address family IPv6 as I told you that for IPv6 address family is disabled for IPv4 address family is by default enabled so that's why we don't need to run address family IPv4 address in case of IPv4 uh, BGP impl implementation uh, with IP version 4 so here I need to run this command after that we need to activate my neighbor so neighbor 12 up double colon 2 and say activate that's it now let me take you on second router router number 2 router BGP 100 and here neighbor is neighbor is 12 up double colon 1 whose remote AS is also 100 after that address family IPv6 done and then neighbor 12 up double colon 1 and say activate done guys now if you want to verify the BGP neighborship simply you need to run command you know to check here you can see the log message as well so my neighborship has come up okay to verify IPv4 BGP neighborship what command you run do so BGP IPv4 unicast summary unicast this command so to check IPv6 here just I need to say IPv6 IP version 6 so it is showing you the neighbor information so neighbor is 12 up double colon 1 and here you can see neighborship is fine done okay now I am going to advertise prefixes on router number 1 which is running on loopback interface so here we need to run command what network after that 192 colon 168 colon 10 double colon 0 slash 64 this is the command to advertise prefixes in BGP in case of IPv6. After that, how to check BGP table? So first of all, how to check BGP neighbor table? As you know, BGP maintain three types of table: neighbor table, BGP table, and routing table. So to 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 check BGP neighbor table, command will be so IP BGP IPv6 unicast summary. This command will show you the neighbor information and to check BGP table you will run command so BGP IPv6 unicast. This is command to check BGP table. So you can see in BGP table router 1 have added this network and this one is valid as well as best so that means this router is going to advertise it to their neighbor to router number 2. So in the routing in the BGP table of router 2 also you can check so I so BGP IPv6 unicast BGP table so here on router number 2 also you can see in BGP table this prefix is there and next of IP address is 12 double colon 1 what is 0 and these are the you know attribute done so router to have install this prefix in their BGP table and this is best as well as valid so it is going to install it in their routing table as well so so IP route BGP here you will not run the command like this so IP v6 route BGP so here you can see in the BGP table there is one prefix yes or no reachable via 12 double colon 1 and if you want to ping ping 192 colon 168 colon 10 double colon 1 you can see i'm able to ping this ip address as well 
okay so this is you know basic configuration of bgp with ipv6 address guys if you have learned something from this video please hit on like button if you have not subscribed this channel please subscribe this channel we will meet soon in next video till then stay safe bye bye guys but if you have any doubt please let me know in the comment section definitely within my capacity i will try to resolve your query okay guys bye bye that's all for today